You know that I'm a microbiologist in my, in my other world. Um, and a year ago, I, um, I previewed this new musical that I'm writing called Bacteria, the Musical. And um, I thought it was only fitting that I'd write another number for tonight. So, um, so you are first to hear it, hot off the press. In fact, it's less than 12 hours old. Um, this is inspired by an article that I read the other day about um, secondhand instruments and how... This is Rhett, everybody. Isn't he nice and shiny? He's a pocket trumpet. Um, it was inspired by this article I read about secondhand instruments that said that especially in school bands, because instruments get passed from one person to another, the kids will like blow into them and all these bacteria will go in there and then they'll pass it on to the next kids and then six months later the bacteria are still in there. So there's like this collection of bacteria. Sorry if you're grossed out by gross things, but this is just, this is what I love. I did a PhD in diarrhea. I just, oh. I, did, I love it. You know? So you just have to put up with it for this song. It's not too gross, I promise. Anyway. So this song is inspired by the idea that, um, that things like trumpets and trombones and um, saxophones, which are collectively known as horns, um, they harbour lots and lots of bacteria that get passed on from one person to another. So um, here it is. Uh, it's called Horns Harbour Horrible Things. <laughs> I remember the words. Listening to high school bands has never been easy But here's some facts that are guaranteed to make you feel even more queasy Every time that you go to a show and hear those trumpet players blow Now you're gonna know that they're just helping bacteria grow Thank you. 